So our gummy worms and soil starts with uh, Oreo cookies that we've uh, cleaned the frosting out of. Now if you have a little helper at home, you can have them clean the frosting a, a different way. Uh, but we're just going to throw these clean cookies into the Roboku and pulse them several times until we get a nice soil-like consistency. What we have here is a combination of isomalt, honey, gum arabic, and a bit of water. We're going to melt that down until we have a nice base. Add a bit of bloomed gelatin to stabilize it. And then for a bit of flavor, we're going to add a, a bit of Tahitian vanilla bean. Here the seeds have been cleaned from the pod. We're just going to whisk that in for a bit of extra flavor. And once we have this base set, we're going to start to slowly emulsify extra virgin olive oil. And we start by whisking it in, but uh, eventually we're going to want to make sure it's completely emulsified in. So what we do is we, we take a hand blender and we just keep blending it until we can see that all the oil has been incorporated into the base. Now these are fishing lures that we bought from a uh, sporting goods store. These will be our worms. After a nice layer of cooking spray, we very carefully spoon in the base of the gummy worms. Now you have to work quick and while it's hot, because otherwise it'll be very hard to cast. So when we plate up here, we're going to put just little mounds of Oreo cookie soil. And then we're going to very carefully, with a bamboo skewer, we're going to dislodge the uh, worms from the mold. And it should be quite easy with the Pam spray once they've set up. And we're just going to drape them in the soil, like worms coming out of the ground. And again, if you have a little helper, plate up is easy. 